Well, a court has cleared the way for the city of Cincinnati parking lease deal to go into effect. Putting the results of possible appeals aside, that means the city now may proceed with a plan to sign a $92 million deal with the Port of Greater Cincinnati Development Authority to lease city parking meters and garages. A majority of council members supported the plan before it was challenged in a lawsuit led by members of the coalition opposed to additional spending and taxes and the local NAACP. The money was originally tagged to plug the city's operating deficit, but now that the city has approved a balanced budget, some council members are questioning how the revenue from the plan should be spent. The mayor says it will go forward as is. And we will move forward with our, our plans to uh, do the lease. Uh, keep in mind that there are uh, a lot of good things that come out of this lease. Uh, the rates for uh, parking in downtown and neighborhoods uh, is based on a schedule, and that schedule is actually pretty slow over the next 15 years. I think it amounts to an increase of maybe a dollar over the next 15 years. So later in the show this morning, we'll walk through this issue in depth to help you better understand the many sides of the issue and where it's headed.